comes the time for all the maneuvering and preparation, all the testing and retesting. When you stop cutting bait and start to fish, it'll clumps, and it will stop floating. At this point in oceanographic exploration, a man can still use his umbilical. Fifty feet high. You have gas enough to go all the way to the bottom. See through the hatch on its floor. Because inside pressure had been equalized with the outside water pressure, the hatch was left open. The gas mixture approximated 96% helium and 4% oxygen, but it was gradually adjusted to 76% helium, 20% nitrogen, and 4% oxygen. The interface of water at the open suffocating condition, they set up gear for scientific experiments along the bottom land of white coral sand. Barracuda, the fearsome creator of one-legged men in the pirate legends, were on their most benign behavior the big fish eat the little fish, said the Latin poet Virgil. The sea may see his fish as neighbors rather than as quarry for his hunting. Dave Helium in the special atmosphere gave a curious quality to men's voices. Everyone sounded like Donald Duck. Topside, a helium unscrambler made the men's voices somewhat more comprehensible. Sea Lab 1, this is Sea Lab Control. Anderson, man the helium unscrambler and give me some test phrases. This is Sea Lab, manned and ready. Are you on? Let's have the test phrases now, please. That's very good. I hear you loud and clear on the scrambler. Twins collecting bottom samples, checking gas cylinders, and taking some recalls. One night, I dreamed I was breathing oxygen from the sea. The sea Lab 1 proved that man does not have to decompress between works and a routine that were in themselves a mute tribute to man's power of adaption. If he words of the late John F. Kennedy, we are just at the threshold of our knowledge of the oceans, he said. Already their military importance 